Naked short selling is another matter altogether. It occurs when someone sells a stock they do not own and have not borrowed. And bad actors can manipulate stocks downward, repeatedly selling something they do not own. And we're here decades later in the exact same spot, if not worse, with louder voices asking for change. We're the greatest experiment ever made known to man because we have an idea called freedom and we fight for it. And the people are uniting. It's everyday mums and dads. We're working hard, we're providing for our family, our children, and we're angry. We ended up in this situation like being stranded on a desert island with a bunch of people from everywhere, from all different backgrounds. Because we're not gonna take this shit no more. The people are now educated. You're dealing with educated investors, a very deadly concoction. It's truly fighting like the 0.5% and they steal from the 99.5%. They paint us as like crazy investors and it's, it's, you know, just dumb retail, but that's not what we are. There was one stock, they've spread it out 10 times. So there's 10 fake stocks out there. Another broker says, there's a share sitting over there, some, it's the same share. I know I can get it if I need it. I think the scope of naked short selling itself is hundreds and hundreds of trillions of dollars, okay? I mean, this is, this is a global problem. Uh, and quite frankly, it's probably a national security problem at this point. Naked short selling shall not be permitted in the Indian securities market. So now what China has done is they're essentially halting the lending of these particular certain shares for short selling as of today. This is a fascinating story. What led to this? Why is Korea banning short selling now and for so long? The reason being naked short selling. What we're touching in this specific instance, which is big, is evil. It's evil. So is the SEC not investigating these actions at all? The, 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 the SEC's role is to investigate. Um, uh, They're just getting shorted. They're getting uh, killed by these toxic lenders, and they have no idea. I think a lot of the CEOs are just trying to build their company, right? And. So they're not thinking somebody's out to destroy them because the people who came to loan them money had smiles on their faces and they were like, go, go, we're really in support of your company, but they're not. We were doing great on the business side and it just didn't match what was going on with the stock price. When they started to convert their shares, uh, at, coupled with the naked shorting, uh, our stock plummeted from about $1.50 to sub penny. That was the demise of our company. And they're looking down and they're laughing. They're, they're laughing at what's happening to the retail investors. They're getting wiped out. The issuers are getting wiped out. Broker gets caught doing what they shouldn't be doing they pay a fine. The reason that this keeps on going, going on, is that nobody goes to jail. One thing is certain, if you don't speak out, nothing's ever gonna happen. I can't